All right, welcome back to another episode of Back Air Football 2004. And the last one, just not a good game. Didn't play well. Uh, turnovers was really what killed us. You know, it started off okay. We got a good defensive stop, but then Dante fumbled, and it all went downhill from there. I feel like whenever we get a fumble on a kickoff, it's just a rough one. It's just, you just you know it's going to be a rough one when Dante fumbles the kickoff. Um, yeah, I mean, offensively, we moved the ball, got a, we outgained them by a ton of yards. We like Portland tripled them in yards, but turnovers, we have that long kick return and just honestly, we just couldn't find the end zone. Only one touchdown. So as unfortunate as that was, the saving grace, the good news is it didn't really affect us in the standings. We are still winning the NFC South, and we are still third in the NFC. So, still in the playoff hunt. Not even the playoff hunt. Still in the playoff spot. And, you know, we win these next last two games. We will guarantee a playoff spot. And, hey, once you're in the playoffs, anything can happen. So, that's what the goal is. Just to build some momentum for the playoffs. And work, move on from there. We're playing the Eagles. Big matchup, as you can see, the Eagles also seven and five, same record as us. Huge game in terms of uh, seeding in the NFC. So this is a very important game uh, for multiple reasons. One, the standings. Two, you can't lose three games in a row. We need to break this losing streak, build some momentum for the playoffs. And three, it just I want to like I want us to be able to beat a good team. If you look at who we've beaten this year, we've beaten our division two times each. So twice Saints, twice Falcons, twice Bucks. That's six of our seven wins is against those teams. And our only other win was when we destroyed the Vikings, who are five and seven. We have not beaten a single team this year with a winning record. I, like, that is just not good. <laughs> it's not good. All of our wins this year are teams with losing records. We have to we have to end that streak today. We have two chances playing the Eagles this week. Last game against the Bengals were ten and two. We we have to prove to ourselves that we can beat a good team. So let's play this game against the Eagles and try to finally get a win against a team with a winning record. Move up to eight and five and end this losing streak we're in. Let's go. Greetings. Are you ready for another action-packed edition of backyard football? I know I am. This is Sunny Day along with the BFL's all-time leader in career-threatening injuries, Chuck Downfield. Thanks, uh, uh, uh wait a minute. Uh, if you're Sunny, then who am I? We've um, got a great game of backyard football lined up for you today. We're broadcasting today's game live from a very damp Moonlight View Drive-In Theater, the Linebackers, and the Philadelphia Eagles. Boy, howdy, are we in for a great time today. Why, I've got half a mind to suit up and join them out there. And if it weren't for this uh, darn trick knee of mine, or was it the trick elbow? I forget. Without further ado, it's time for some backyard football. Boom's won. All right, let's see. We're playing at home. Boom's got the ball. He He's tired of Dante's fumbles. That was a nice return set up by the old flying wedge play. Linebackers at home. Again, 7-5 linebackers versus 7-5 and five Eagles. Let's see what we can do here. First down and 20. Go. We're going to throw. Tony down Boom's right open. Slings it. Oh, that's a terrible start. This is That's not a good sign. A not a good down. sign. Boom was wide open. He turned around for the ball, too. He just dropped it. And I forgot to look at the Eagles team. They go to the air. Another drop. Okay, okay. It's going to be one of those games. All right, we're going to have to overcome. Let's take a look at the Eagles, though. Forgot to do this. So they do have McNabb, but they're using him as a running back. Interesting. They got Mickey O'Connor at quarterback, although he's playing down today. Pass. Everything is down today. McNabb is running back. Jim K. Ramona. Um, at receiver, Zena from from at center, and Bobby and Matessa Sturgis, I think. I mean, not a. I mean, honestly, the team's not that great. They, like Zena from is good and McNabb is good. Other than that, though, they don't like have a great team. 
We really, we really should beat them. Boom is already, it's every game, it's either Dante or Boom or like that messes up for us. This Today it's looking like it's Boom that's messing up for us. Let's see what we got here. They have a power up. All right, Boom, he makes the catch, turns it upfield, and he's going to find the end zone. Let's go. We needed that one. He took the bait on that one. All right, he just needed he 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 didn't want to run as much. He he didn't want those short passes. He wanted a longer one. Go, go, we go, learned. Go. We uh, Crank we adjusted. It. We got the touchdown. Here's the kick. Okay, we are the seven nothing lead. Let's play some defense. Our defense has not played well. I mean, actually, I take it back. Last game, our defense didn't play terrible. It looks uh, like Ricky Johnson. We just haven't been getting turnovers. That's a, we haven't been forcing any interceptions or recovering any fumbles. It's we need not. to get some turnovers going here. We've been losing the turnover battle almost every game lately. I didn't think they were going to be able to catch that kid. First and 20, 37-yard line. Mickey O'Connor, guns. That's a okay, we'll take that. We'll take that. They're dropping Second it too. Down. We could use some good luck. We haven't had much this season. We'll take all the good luck we can get. Looking for the open receiver. That and there's a, a sack. Play, that saved six. Third down. All right, all right. One more, one more stop, and you get the ball back. Third and long, 33-yard line. Looks like they're going to the air here. Yeah, and another sack. Okay. Okay. Back to back sacks. We got a power up. We got two power ups. Much, much better start to this one than the last game. I am uh, I'm liking the way this game is starting. This could be a good one. Matessa Sturges back for the kick. Bounces on the ninth. I'm not sure if the wind caught that one or what, but I think that punt was. Alright, we're in good field position. First and 20, but looking to throw. Uh-oh. Tony Del Vecchio passes Mickey up. No, Mackie Ernie. For the first quarter. Couldn't, I, I tried to throw up a 101 for Ernie. Didn't come down with it. Everyone's covered. Probably should have just thrown that first one away. 20, Got a little greedy there. Line. Drops back to pass. They send it airmail. Uh-oh. Ernie, can you get there? That kid could catch well, they goal. dropped it. Second their their team is uh their their offense. I said they didn't look that good. They're, they they don't look that fast. They got some butterfingers, so might long. luck out here. Eight yard line. They go to the running back again. What? What is he doing? Why is Ernie not? Why is Ernie and Ricky running in place? Did you see that? Ernie and Ricky just got glitched out. And they were running in place. Oh boy, it's another game where another thing goes against us. Booms one. Ernie and Ricky, I can never like they they look exactly the same, their character models. That's why I like the older games better. Like the older games, you could e e clearly tell who was who. This game is like I don't know. But anyway, one of them or both of them were just running in place. And did not move for to make the tackle. That was a nice return. So, so by the old flag right, flag. once again, we find ourselves having to fight not only the Eagles but the backyard football gods. First down and twenty. They're looking to throw. Throws it to the Ernie's back. open, and he dropped it. Oh boy! <laughs> oh boy! Oh boy, this game's gonna be the death of me. And long, 36 yard line. They go to the air. Inter and another interception. Oh boy. What started, what, what, the game looked like it was promising to start out, and now not so much these last couple drives. That one rattled my grinders. It'll be second down. Trying to save the power-ups for the second half. Because we might not get any more. Second down, 38-yard line. 
going to throw. They send it airmail. All right, we got another power up. Third down here for the, the Philadelphia Eagles. We'll save those all for the second half. Third down and 38 yard line. Looking to throw. Going to the air. Maybe that kid ought to pick it up. I mean, they got butterfingers too. Down. They're not catching anything. I feel like this. It must. It must be the rain. Honestly, it must be the rain. Fourth down and 38 yard line. Crank it up a notch. They going for the field goal? It is up. No way that went in. Yeah, it's, it's short. This team has more points than the other guys, which means they're winning. I tell you, Sonny, this is why I love baseball. <sighs> I mean, not. We gave up one play. We literally just one play we gave up, and that was all it took. So. Ricky Jones, I don't know. I don't know what to make of that half. A lot of drops on offense. We do have a few power-ups on defense, though. Hopefully, we can turn that into something good for us. Oh, fumble. Ricky. Ricky. Oh, my God. Thank you. Finally, we got one to go our way. Finally, we got one to go our way. You know how many times Dante has fumbled the kickoff this year and they recovered? At least three. I actually don't know. It's at least been three times, maybe four. Um, that's the first time that's gone our way, though. I feel like. Oh my god, thank you. The football gods, the backyard football gods finally smiled upon us and gave us one. They finally threw us a bone. They've been giving us our toughest, their toughest challenges all year. They finally gave us a bone there. We finally recovered a fumble, too. We've, like, forced fumbles, but we never... Oh, Ricky, he got another one. I probably could have returned that back if I didn't run backwards to start. All right, all right. Uh, that, thank you. Thank you, Becker Football Gods. Thank you for smiling upon us. Tony Delvecchio, complete to Slab Bash Pal. That's what I'm talking about. Brings up a second down. Try running it. Honestly, I'll take a field goal at this point. Second down and eight hands it off. Dante, he's through. He's in. Touchdown. Let's go. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. We finally got some good luck. Finally got some good luck to go our way. Oh, I might have missed that one. Nope, it's good. I lied. Oh, uh, yes. We finally... Finally got some good luck. The Eagles are now starting to see what Ricky I have to go Johnson through every game. Kick off. Watch out for the tacklers. The kick. Good kick, Ricky. All right, we can use some power-ups here. You think we can force another fumble? First and 20, 20 yard line. Looking <laughs> for the open receiver. <laughs> Up by so we did force the fumble, but we Long didn't recover at that time. That's okay, though. That's all right. Let's try the spring loaded. It never works. They always jump too far over, but, you know, it's fun to use, I guess. Contrary to popular belief, Sonny, defense has little to do with an actual defense. All right. I mean, look at these powers we're getting. We're finally getting it to go our way. Let's use the stone cold. Maybe we can get a safety. Third down and a long way to go. He's going to throw. Base it. Pulled in. Oh, Run another back. fumble. And we got it this time. like a greased pig out there. Holy cow. I feel like, I mean, we're using up all of our luck in this one. <laughs> this is, we have, have you ever First seen us get this much good luck in one game before? Line. I haven't. That was a good play, Sonny. That saved six. That brings up second down. Let's try the flood. The flood usually works from this range, I feel. At least on the two-point tries. Second and go. goal. 11-yard line. Going to the air. Boom, boom. Touchdown. What a throw from Tony. 
teamwork. <laughs> Boom in the corner. All right, this is more like it. This is more like it. We needed this one. We needed this. We needed the momentum. They wasted their cough drop on an extra point. I mean, the Eagles are just flustered right now. They don't know what to do. They don't know what hit them. They're desperate. They're using cough drops on an extra point. Ricky Johnson is going to be kicking off. This was this felt good. This was a good one. I, it just feels good to get some luck go our way, you know? I didn't think they were going to be able to catch that kid. That it just feels nice to have think some things go our way. All right, let's finish strong. Ah, I went out of bounds. I was actually there, too, if it stayed in bounds. Uh, I was coming in to pick that ball up, run it back the other way. Second and 45 yard line. Gives it to yep, that. McNabb. Like, this spring loaded play has got to be the worst one. It's got to be the worst one. She jumps like 10 yards over where she's supposed to land. It's, it's, it's just, I don't, I don't know. I don't get it. And the sack. Yeah, our defense uh, came out to play today. We gave that one long run, but other than that, not 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 too bad. Oh, another another sack, another fumble. Sometimes big guys try to pick it up and run with it, and that's when trouble starts. First and 20, 47 yard line. Fired into the flat. Ernie? Nah, too far. Who they were throwing that to. Second down. We haven't done the swinger in a while. Let's try it out. Maybe Dante is feeling like catching it today. Second down and a ways to go. 47 yards. Nah, he's not. He's not feeling it today. We'll try it one more time, then we'll punt it. Like, the swinger's a good play when it works. It just, he never... It never feels like catching it. Third down and a long way to go. 40. Oh, in. he caught it. And he's around. Let's go, Dante. He's around the bend and he's going to take it in for the end zone for a touchdown. Did you see what they just did? All right. Much, much, much better game this game than we've had in the last couple. Here we go. I shouldn't, even, I shouldn't even say the whole game. It was the second half that really turned it around. They are wasting these power-ups on these extra points, man. They really should have used that one, like, the like you know, on the touchdown play. Would have stopped it. will be doing the kicking. Here's the kick. Another good kick from Ricky. Kid puts the special in special. I wonder how many fumbles they have this game. It's got to be like four at least, right? I mean, that's just insane. We never get fumbles to our way. 27 yard line drops back. They go complete. Somebody get that kid some aspirin. That brings up six seconds down. left. Might be the last play of the game. Might be two more plays, but should be a 35 to seven win. Seven yard line keeps it on the ground. Another game has come to a close, and the linebackers put the squeeze on the competition for a sweet victory. For Chuck Downfield, this is Sunny Day. I hope you all enjoyed this game as much as we did. So long. I mean, 35 points, and we got half the yards we got last game when we got seven. I mean, we got, well, we had the fumble for a touchdown, another fumble that set up a touchdown. Um... What is that? Another fumble? Is that, like, they have four, four turnovers, all fumbles, I think. Um, yeah, we, we finally got some power-ups, too, that helped us. Uh, they had some drops. We, we just finally got lucky, you know? We finally got some good luck to go our way. It felt, it felt good. And there it is. We clinched the playoff spot. There it is. Fans celebrate in the bleachers and streets. You can hear them celebrating from the locker rooms all the way across the city. 
With today's big win, the linebackers clinched the playoffs. Well, it was a long season, but with the help of my teammates and today's victory, we made it in the playoffs. Woo, Ricky Johnson said after. All right. No, I, didn't, I haven't even been reading these. Everyone awaits the outcome. Uh, Valley Joe's fighting to lead the linebackers to the playoffs. Everything we've been playing going the last game. Oh, almost to the... Oh, okay, so this is uh, still today, yes. So, every game counts. We're playing them. Everything we got going to the last game of the season. The cards have not shown us who will end up playing as the regular season is ended. Okay. So, yes, we have one more game against the Bengals before the playoffs. So, let's take a look at the league report, at the standings. So, the Seahawks are in first. We almost had them. I mean, that, that makes me feel a little bit better, knowing that this, if the Seahawks are the best team in the league, and we almost had them. We had them on the ropes. We were one point. We only lost them by one point. That makes me feel a little bit better that knowing we know we can play them tough. Same with the Rams. We know we can play them tough. I think we have a good chance in the playoffs. I really do. We just have to, you know, hopefully the, the football gods smile upon us and don't give us any of these, you know, dumb turnovers, dumb fumbles off the kickoff. Those are the ones that I just can't stand. The interceptions I can deal with, they're on me. But these fumbles on the kickoffs, I mean, there's just, like, what do you, what, what can you do? It's just, it's unlucky. But we are only, uh, only one game left against the Bengals, who are 10-3. and three. They are first in the AFC, so it's going to be an interesting one. But we are in the playoffs no matter what, so that's that's great to see. Uh, let's take a look at this, our, our, uh, our individual stats. Tony, 71 out of 135, 3,424 yards. So one more game left, probably go over 3,500 passing yards. So pretty good game, pretty good season. Uh Booms at 17.82. Dante's at 12.27. Boom, 17 touchdowns. So, again, pretty good. Dante, uh, 12 touchdowns here. So, Dante's got, what is that, 12 and 6. So, Dante's got 18 touchdowns. Boom has 19, 17, and uh, 17 and 2. So, 19 touchdowns for Boom, 18 for Dante. Pretty pretty even. Uh, let's take a look. Defense, Kimmy, 34 sacks. Uh, again, we haven't really been getting the interceptions lately, but that's okay. And field goals, yep, extra points. Still only the one miss. All right, um, that's going to do it for this one. I'll take a look at the league leaders in the next one when, uh, the, you know, the end of the season. We'll do a wrap-up of the end of the season stats and look over everything, look at the playoff tree and all that. But your uh, your your linebackers have officially clinched the playoffs with this win. The next one, like I said, we'll be playing the Bengals and hopefully build some more momentum going in the playoffs and improve our seeding. Uh, we won't be the one seed. The Seahawks have clinched the one seed, but still, you know, it would be nice to uh, have home home field advantage in round one. So that's going to do it for this one. Until next time, catch y'all later.